More than $2 million worth of equipment from Berry's National Foods Factory has gone under the hammer. Melbourne-based company JW Styles was running the auction. Some machinery will be sent as far afield as the Philippines, but it's believed many of the items will remain in the Riverland. The local market's quite strong, and um, as is evidenced by the crowd uh, behind us here, um, bidding away frantically on some of the um, um, items and I think that the, the catalogue represents a great range for all, all manners of buyers from large to small. 12,000 lots were listed for auction. The most expensive item, a plastic moulding machine, went for more than $170,000. The factories themselves will now be sold. The final employee on site will finish tomorrow. The last workers signed off at the Berry National Foods Factory uh, today. The factory has gradually been downsized since November last year when National Foods announced it would shut down all operations at the site. Equipment was auctioned off yesterday. Maintenance contractors will be in the factory until mid-August, removing leftover equipment before the building goes up for sale. More than 100 local, uh, locals lost their jobs with only four relocated to the Berry office. National Foods continues to source fruit from contracted growers in...